Hi everyone. Kicking back, it's a snow day for all those kids who are in school here in Colorado Springs. Um, I'm home and grateful. Um, this past weekend, I went to Gunnison, Colorado. It's on the west western slope. It's uh, a place I've never been. I've lived in Colorado 33 years. I've never crossed over the west side. So. We uh, took 32 kids to visit uh, Western State College in Gunnison, Colorado. And we left, by the time we left Colorado Springs, it was dark. So people kept talking about Monarch Pass. And I tell you, I have not heard anything fun about Monarch Pass. So. We leave and we go through Canyon City and I thought the treacherous drive that we went through to get to Salida, Colorado was Monarch Pass. So I was all relieved when we got to Salida because we had went over the pass. I said, well, it wasn't that bad. So as we are at a local McDonald's so the kids could get something to eat, one of the drivers, who is one of our, my colleagues, said, we have not gotten to Monarch Pass. We will be going over soon. Anxiety heightened. So we get in and we go through Monarch Pass and it is dark and it is curvy. It is high, it is steep, and it is terrifying. But we get through. So we get to Gunnison, which is not too far away from Monarch Pass after you get over the pass. So it's a pretty town, and I'm so relieved, so thankful, praising God for being in the car with us as we go, and I'm good until we get to the hotel. And all of the anxiety, panic attack just sunk in. Because my thoughts were, oh my gosh, we got to go back through that. So I couldn't sleep that night. I was so anxious. I couldn't sleep. And then we got up and we went to the college to do their, it's some kind of um, discovery day. And so we did the tour. We went to all the events. And the whole day, all I'm thinking is getting back through Monarch Pass and through all those mountains. But I don't think I didn't have a good day, but it did quite interrupt my day. And it seemed like it took forever for us to leave. And so as we were leaving, it wasn't quite as dark when we hit Monarch Pass. Okay, so, oh my gosh. It's worse when you see it. So, I mean, the scenery is beautiful, but you could see straight down the edge of the mountain and there were no guardrails. And it's a thin road going through the mountain for seven miles. The longest seven miles of my entire life. So what was scary at night was terrifying by day and this lady who was driving she did a good job she kept saying well I don't want to look over the side and I was like don't and so we had three vans going and uh one of the things I really am thankful for is that the Holy Spirit was in that van with me both ways because not one time did I panic and I'm talking about I usually panic when I realize I'm in the middle of nowhere and I'm far from anywhere and I will panic. And not once did I panic going or coming from those distance. I enjoyed the ride. It was scary, but it was like I still enjoyed the ride. Now, will I do that again? Hopefully never, ever, ever again. I never need to see the western part of Colorado. And for that matter, I don't see the need to see the utter north, northern part. I don't need to see the highest part. We already high enough here in Colorado Springs, Denver, the Mile High City, that's fine. All I need to do is see south. How do I head up out of here? Been here 33 years, we'll be living here, probably live and die here. 
but the Colorado Springs is beautiful and today we woke up to snow and I was just surprised that uh, the schools were closed. I was going to take my granddaughters to school today, but they're closed. <sighs> I remember when I used to work and they would say school closed. It was the best thing ever. It's still the best thing ever, but it doesn't really affect me except for today because my daughter has, she teaches Zumas in the morning and I was supposed to take the kids to school. So I don't have to. So God is good. And I hope you guys are enjoying your morning. I am staying in, staying warm, staying happy, staying blessed. Y'all have a good one. Bye.